Now, it's a landmark deal. The leaders of the BRICS nations are forging a multi-billion dollar financial alliance. The world's top five emerging economies agreed on Tuesday to establish a development bank to rival Western-dominated institutions like the IMF and the World Bank. Connie Kim reports on the landmark agreement that could radically overhaul the existing global financial order. The leaders of the five BRICS nations have signed a deal to launch a hundred billion U.S. dollar development bank and a currency reserve pool with the aim of challenging Western-dominated institutions like the World Bank and the International Monetary Fund. The new development bank announced at the sixth BRICS summit in Fortaleza, Brazil on Tuesday will fund infrastructure projects in the founding members, Brazil, Russia, India. China and South Africa, as well as other developing nations. With its headquarters in Shanghai and India as president the first year, the bank will start out with $50 billion in capital with each BRICS country paying in an equal amount. Total capital is expected to eventually double to $100 billion. A so-called contingent reserve arrangement will also be created where each country will put in a designated amount in case of a currency crisis. The contingency fund will amount to $100 billion, with China contributing $41 billion, followed by Brazil, Russia and India putting in $18 billion each, and South Africa chipping in $5 billion. BRICS represents about 42 percent of the world's population and accounts for roughly one-fifth of the world economy. The launch of the institution is being seen as a landmark achievement as the five countries started summit talks in 2009 to counter the influence of the West. If everything goes according to plan, the new development bank will start lending in 2016. Connie Kim, Arirang News.